Alrighty, hi, hello, how are things? My name is Sierra Black. I'm gonna be playing Disney Dreamlight Valley. I'm just very chill. I don't have any really big plans for today. Um, I just wanna do some gardening and like some general maintenance stuff. I might change my outfit. Um, I have, oh, I guess I should show a little bit of my valley. There have been changes and updates, but then I get on YouTube. Oh, this is my living room. I think I've made some changes to it. I'm not sure. I know I added this. I added this teapot because I was trying to do something, but now I hate it. So, yeah, there's my living room, but my living room is mostly the same. I really can't remember at all. Truly, life is can be really lost in this game. Okay, and then this is my kitchen. I feel like I added these lights. And, oh, these stools for sure, I added these recently. Even though I feel like if I find some better ones, I'm going to change them. And, oh, is there any on? Oh, no. Okay. So let's go over here. We have my flower room, my flower room that is, um, well I guess it's more of like a metal room. I think it's getting pretty like ridiculous. Seeing I put my little broom in here with the hands. I think I'm gonna buy some more of these flowers right here. Maybe make a row over here in this corner. And then this table's a little off. I think I wanted it. Ah. There we go. Oh, I can't, like, make it in the middle. Oh, no. Well, then I have to move it, because it's going to bother me. It is really pretty, though. Okay, well, we just have to remove it. Okay, a crazy metal room. Over here. Oh, I don't think I did this last time. I made my library slash, like, study. Oh, and I was able to... These have a nice glow to them, and I put them on this little chest. These are Monsters Ink bookcases. I think they look really good. I ended up putting the fireplace in the middle of the room. I don't know if it's like the best thing for space management, but I like the way it looks. My fiery mirror over a little desk. Some potions over there. And then upstairs. I basically just built a second living room, but I would call this more of like a media room because it has like a TV, a computer, another TV. So there's like a sewing area over here. Over here I just have like some decor decorative stuff. I also finally built a legit like uh, storage room for stuff, but I just put extra stuff up here. I don't know if I'm, like, I have just too much stuff. Oh, and I put another crafting station in there. This is going to be my bathroom. I really haven't started on it, but I did put these windows in here. I guess this, well, that doesn't make sense for this to be my bathroom. Maybe it'll be something else. Maybe I'll put a bathroom on the next floor, because, like, who says I need to have a bathroom here? All right, my bedroom. Oh, I think I was going to put a rug here. I want to see what this rug looked like here. Uh, not ideal. But I'm just trying to see if it's like a placeholder for the time being. Hmm. 
I'll, I'll live with that. We have this table, which I think this table actually might be a little too big for a vanity, but mirror, the bedroom. Go to the third floor. I don't know. I think I had this as storage. Now I just like use it to look at wallpaper, I guess. But that's it. And then if there's any other things I did, I'll just do it as I go. Let's untrack. Oh yeah, and I have like these quests. I probably should finish these quests. Oh no, go back into the light. I never changed your outfit. I was, I'm so disappointed that this is the tangled hair. You know how the end of, not the end of Tangle, but the middle of Tangle with the, when the three triplets braid her hair? I think this is supposed to represent that. And I was hoping that we would get like the actual thing. Do I want to put on another dress? Oh yeah, I finally got this. That's really pretty. And I like that in pink. I don't know, I don't know if I'm really feeling a dress today. It's just so um, rare for me. I'm just trying to think of something of maybe... Iron Siegel made like a really good point when he was saying it'd be great if you could save outfits. Oh, maybe that corduroy skirt. Is that what I had on? Maybe a little prints. That blue jacket maybe? Actually, I was kind of feeling these sweaters the other day. Let's do that one. Skirts. Oh, that's not gonna work. I mean, I feel like we could get away with this red skirt. I don't know if it like a hundred percent matches. Wait, let's do that skirt. These, because sometimes when you wear the black skinny jeans, you can make them look like tights, kind of. Oh, the sweater's like a jacket. blue jacket and then maybe just a t-shirt under it oh this little thing with the boot that's cute all right and then uh, hairstyle yeah let's do the knots Okay, we're all dressed and ready to go. Do you need any more berry salad before we leave the house? No, you have 12. Oh, I have my little creepy raccoon over here. And then I guess these just need to be sold. And then I should have put in my flower thing, but I'll do it later. Just one of these. Yeah, I've been taking um, these like CBD dump gummies that have just a little, a little bit of THC in it. So, uh, I took one earlier. I should be fine though, but sometimes I will just 
forget what I'm doing and run around in circles because I can't focus on what's in front of me, so. I might do that. I might do that. But the gummies have definitely really helped me sleep. And helped when I'm feeling anxious, which is often. And this game is definitely really relaxing. I think I breach certain moments of burnout sometimes on it. Like, part of me wants to just, like, get through everything. So, I can just focus on decorating, but sometimes decorating feel, can feel, like, really overwhelming. And I haven't decorated that much, and there's, like, some sort of limit where you can only have 600 items or something. And that's really making me nervous. Like, I don't know if I need to reassess the way I'm decorating where I already have too much stuff because I don't feel like I even have done that much here over here oh no nothing was watered ah, so it shouldn't take too long to replant everything or at least for it to grow and then I can plant Oh, and I put this clock tower up here. I'm still not sure what I want to do with it. I was thinking of maybe doing like an ice rink. Um, but I'm not sure how I would exactly do that. I probably could do it with some pavement and pathing. And then over here, Kristoff and Elsa put some flowers in front of their place. I made a driveway for their sled. And then these cherry trees along the path. Maybe, hopefully we'll get maybe another bio, bio, biodome. Or I can put some more cherry trees. Interesting. I feel like I'm always waiting for there to be iron there, even though I know it's not going to happen. Let's go down to the beach. I don't think I've done too much. I've just been kind of placing stuff until I kind of think of what I'm going to do. And then, oh, let's go ahead and get some fish. Thank you so much. And over here, my idea is to create some sort of like lounge over on Ariel's Island. I think it'd probably be easier once I do that, but I'm trying to savor it. But also, if you wait too long, things can't get snack stagnant for sure. Oh, hey, Merlin. Oh, you're not gonna speak? Oh. you to do. 
Oh, hey, Donald. Oh, sorry, you need to eat. Oh, actually, Glade of Trust is actually, like... I've done some stuff with that, actually. Hello? Merlin? People aren't saying hi to me. Did I have voices off? Mm, no. I guess just nobody wants to talk to me. Oh, yay! Something to harvest. No, I won't do you a favor at all. Uh. Alright, and... Oh no. Can we sell these before I accidentally plant them? And then I'll be so mad and I'll be so upset. Okay. So, do I need all this fish? Probably not, but okay. Come over here. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Goofy, for helping me, assisting me today. And plant. more companions like for sure I have no companions which would probably like I'm planning on using that to keep myself occupied before the November update even though I feel like we're kind of into November with I've made any announcement And I wonder if the update for November is going to be like, maybe even more Christmas if they do it after Thanksgiving. I definitely want to unlock a fox. Oh, and I have, um, oh, Moana just gave me lobster, I think. I think I can at least feed some to some of the alligators. I don't know. Now I'm missing my princess dress. Kind of want to put it back on. Uh, oh, and I put these pink lights all through here. Oop, get that. I think they look really good in this area. Oh my gosh, I can't remember who did the video, but somebody did move Minnie's house to Glade of Trust, and it looks so good, and now I cannot stop thinking about it, even though I do love my little tomb town. And then over here, I got this little... I don't know if I already talked about this, but... I got this little uh, checkers board and then put it on these tables and then use these little pumpkin benches 
And then with the clock tower, I think it looks really cool here. And then I did the blue lights around it instead of the pink. Kind of separate it. And I like how it looks from pretty much all angles. I think it looks really good there. But, um, whoever did do that, I'm gonna link their video later because it was so, so good. And they did all the lavender around it. And this is Merlin's house. Ooh. We got it. Cool. Got Mother Gothel still over there. Even though I would love to just evict Mother Gothel from the valley altogether. Yay! So much iron. I was really gonna make a point to as much iron as possible and assign all like the rest of my characters as mining um but every time i mine with a character they get stuck in the they get like stuck in the rock i don't know if anybody else is experiencing that issue and then um oh, let's go in here and, oh, I put a little chest here, too, so I can have a little stopping, stopping point. So, mushrooms. And then I also organized this to be, like, things I can, like, grab and put away so I can make more space at all times. Let's keep the lobster, but we can put a lot of this other stuff over And uh, these gems. Oh, and this garlic, of course. I'm just making room. This can be sold. I can go over. Okay. And then this will be easy. Molly's so sweet for growing these vegetables, and then all I do is take them and immediately resell them. Here. Hey! I think wheat and sugar are the only things I keep because those are really the only things I need. And then let's get this guy. Nope. No? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There we go. go up oh and this is probably what I've done like the most with I feel like oh I've, I was able to get all these lights right here in this area I think it looks really good we got Scrooge's store why is the Scrooge's store empty those little things right there I haven't gone in there today um oh the two lakes that I surrounded by this fencing that I really like. I'll close this area off. Here, Remy's house, the restaurant. I like these candles on top of these tables out here. And I think I might change this to yellow flowers because coming around here, I have all these yellow flowers here and I really like how that looks. Here. No? Okay. You got it, you got it, you got it. 
And then uh, my little Toontown, the banana trees, and the community garden. I think I added some more stuff to like this little table. Humans are amazing. Oh my gosh, Remy, Stubborn you scare creed. the crap out of me every single time. You're too small. I'm gonna tie a bell to you or something. Okay, and then I started this little paving. I don't think I had enough, and I don't think I ever finished it, but here's the paving onto here. Oh, and I made a little coffee shop. I forgot. Little stools and tables, and then there's like this little cart, and it has a little coffee cup and a coffee. I forget what it's called. It's some sort of cart some sort of coffee cart and then I put a blender and some bananas my little universe in my head is that Mickey uh, comes out here every morning and then just has coffee waiting for everybody oh and then I made kind of like a little well with flowers around it then I need to finish this pathing and then yeah yeah more flowers more trees all right well, let's go up here Um, uh, I think this may be even, like, look, look, oh. oh. Thank you. Let's see. I might be able to show this better. This is definitely still a work in progress. It's like, uh, a park. I think maybe I'll put a bunch of flowers in here and kind of make a path that way. I'm not sure. And then we have, like, this little swimming pool surrounded by these bushes. So, there's rocks going in. So the idea is to make this a park and extend. Over here we have the pool. And for a while I had this area completely empty once I moved my house, so it's nice to just at least have stuff in here. And I think I extended out my little market that I was building through here. Oh, I made like a little furniture, secondhand spot. Put some more tables out here. Hopefully I'll add more stuff as time goes on. Um, but here is my probably big pumpkin patch. I'm thinking of maybe building another big pumpkin patch. I don't know, I see people with like 8,000, I'm sorry, not 8,000, not 8,000 at all. Like $8 million, $9 million. And I'm like, oh, I, I just got my 1 million and I thought I was like, cool. And I'm not, I'm not cool. Not a surprise, but I just thought I was doing well. And I'm not, well, but this is great because I hope anybody who watches my video, unlike me when I watch other people's videos, um, they'll be able to watch my video and feel better about themselves because I literally, there's so much more I think I could have done. I never can tell if there's fog in this game or it just seems like that. Oh yeah, I got more berry salads. Right here for you. Yeah, so once I get done with all of my gardening, um, I probably should finish Scar's quest. I guess. Or maybe Eric. Actually, let's do. Let's finish Eric's quest first, and then we can do Scar. this. Mother Gothel, you are following me around. You're following me around and it's weird. At least I got to see Wally.
There we go. Creepy raccoon. Uh, I like. Okay. Sorry, I feel like I can't see see my stream. there's like some sort of digital goblin that YouTube could have that would tell me how everything's going. Like they tell you how the connection is, but I'm always worried about the audio. And hopefully next year I'll be able to buy a cam link, which I would be So excited to change, to upgrade the quality of video I'm able to do. Today I was fully fell into a black hole of making a farmer's market in The Sims. And I do think it came out very cute, but I was just like, well, maybe I'll just make it go into the lot and make an outline. So I can think about it and think about how I want it to look and then I just fully just built the whole thing. Which I did record the footage, but when I build for, especially like this family let's play that I'm doing, when I build for that, sometimes I like leave things unfinished because I like multifunctional lots in the sense. So I leave things unfinished in case I want to add something else later. So I'm not sure if I should be releasing half finish speed builds or unless I can call it that maybe. I'll title them half finish speed builds for my sums. Something like that. I just like a lot of flexibility in my game. But it's great that I finished that because now the only other thing I really need to do is stock the grocery store. And that's a grocery store I got off the gallery, so. I was just thinking, well, it would have been great because I just watched, um, Gosh, I just watched Disenchanted. I really wasn't that big a fan of it. Um, I think it could have been way funnier. And also it feels so filmed during COVID, sort of. Like just so many people just talking in rooms and doesn't really feel that magical or expansive. Even though it seems like they paid a lot of money for well, I don't know if a lot of money, but it does seem like they're paid attention to detail in terms of costuming, but I don't know, it just didn't feel like mad, especially since the first one is like in New York City. I was going to say filmed in New York City, but I don't know. It's probably filmed in Canada or something. Ooh, I don't feel like I had one of these yet today. Oh, Donald throwing a tantrum against the grass. I hope I have enough. Do I have enough pumpkins? I'm at uh, 
But Amy Adams, her acting is amazing. The film sort of like rests on her acting ability. And also I think, um, even though I love Maya Rudolph, I think she was a little miscast for the queen or the adversary. It's like they didn't really want to commit to... I mean, I guess I shouldn't spoil it. It's it's cute enough if anybody wants to watch it, but... It's like they didn't want to commit to making her the villain. Which I think you probably could see in the trailer. Which if they were going to do a storyline where she's the villain, I think they should have just went for it. Um, but anyway, my idea was like... I'm so surprised they didn't add Giselle to the game as like a cross promotion it won't really tell me what's going on or maybe it's my internet thing my internet has been going uh <laughs> going in and out so that would be a nice surprise if this all just shuts down on me oh no i don't i'm not gonna have enough pumpkins i'm gonna have to go Oh yeah, I just told myself that. Alright, are my other... The map. I'm trying to see if my other plots have... Nope, okay. Our way. Oh, we can go into mines. Oh, and I can dig this up because I need more. Well, I guess that's not true. I don't need more clay, but I just love having stuff. I just love collecting stuff and having it and being able to see it. Oh, and the lolly stuff is over here. I think I gave him like this little pond too. I think Wally has a nice little area over here. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, get this one. No? trying to think like for disenchanted what did i really want from the movie other than it feeling like bigger grander more epic i think the songs were pretty decent but i would i guess i want to see also i would want them to stay in new york maybe they can move to like another another bureau or something but just made the movie seem really small. Or they should have moved to Los Angeles. Maybe Giselle gets a record deal. She does have a beautiful voice. But then that just turns into like Lady Gaga. That Lady Gaga movie with Bradley Cooper. I mean, I would watch it, but I don't know if that's the market they were going for. And it feels kind of very like, you know, I don't know. It just feels almost like Hocus Pocus 2 as well. Where if you're trying to get those millennial dollars, you should just cater the movie completely to that audience, I feel like.
but when you try to make like nostalgia like content we still try to make it be something else I don't know I don't know if that works because Disenchanted is like 10 years ago so even if people watched it when they were a kid To me, it makes more sense to just tell an adult story, you know? Okay. And then... I'm so sorry, this is gonna be like... So ridiculous. Oh, hey, Scar. But... Every couple of days, I dig up this entire thing. gives me clay and it gives me pebbles and it's just like a nice organized way to make sure I'm staying stocked on those things and I'm sure you're supposed to collect things because ideas that you get crafting but I just haven't felt that inspired to decorate and usually, this has been like my daily routine. I come home from work and then I clock into Disney Dreamlight Valley. So every day I've just been kind of like making my rounds around the valley. And then uh, when I'm done, I check Scrooge's store to see if I can buy anything with the fruits of my labor. And recently, I really haven't seen anything that I really like. Um, here, go right here. No. If I dig it up, I always redig it because. Can't just have one hole there, that would be insane. Oh, and there's like a chest stuck back here. I can't get, oh, I can move his house. I did not realize that. I mean, it wouldn't really make sense anywhere else. Oh, but I have to see what it looks like in the glade. Can we see? Will it, will it really let me move it or is it just like pretending to let me move it? Obviously... Oh, I'm so curious. I don't think I have any room for it anywhere. It's pretty big. Hmm. Right here? You can. I did not realize you could move his house. I'm obsessed with that. Um, okay, just keep digging. I mean, who am I joking? I'm not burnt out on this game at all. I just want more money. just takes up a, a lot of energy. Oh, also, I probably should mention this when I went through the mines. There's like a lot of these things, whatever spawns the metals and the minerals. There's a lot of them that I just don't deal with because I don't feel like turning the camera around and going through the caves like that. So usually I'll just ignore it. And, like, yeah, ignore them and not use them. Ugh. Come on, Sierra. Oh, hey, Maui. I feel like I haven't seen you in a while, man. Make everybody mad or something? 
Ow. Not even like... I hate mornings or anything. Okay. Oh, and I do hope with the Thanksgiving update that we can make a turkey, like a turkey dinner. Oh, hang on. Let's move this. Wonder where I can find some chocolate. Oh, hey. Are you talking to me? No, I don't. I don't. I guess you're not. Why are, you, why are you talking to me? It's because I ignore everybody and once I get you to level 10, I never talk to you again. Uh, hello? Wow. Yeah, this takes a lot of energy, but the good thing is after a couple of days, it will all fill in by itself and that's when I know to do it again. Oh, there are these, like, flower bushes that do... Hey, little raccoon. Oh, I never fed that alligator. Dang. Okay. Vanilla. You too, Wally? Well, actually, maybe the Wally did say hi when my back was turned. Gosh, I wonder if I should have moved my house here. Gosh, and since you can move Scar, <gasps> this would be a cool place for a house just in this like enclosing. Ugh, too close. I keep like playing, switching back and forth between Disney Dreamlight and The Sims. And then in The Sims, I straight up will try to like move the sim with the arrow keyboards. I'm just like, oh gosh. And then people try to suggest to me new games, but I'm always like, I'm playing Disney Dream Life Valley in The Sims. Like I have no time or space in my life for anything else. Uh, oh yeah, I'm gonna go through probably a lot of these. And then with the more energy, do you just like run faster or, or am I digging faster? I can't tell. I guess if I can't tell, then it probably doesn't matter. No. No. It must. Okay. Merlin, you good? I 
Oh, and Merlin's my foraging buddy. Maybe we should go... Maybe it'll help me get some more dark wood. Everybody in my game is broken today. I don't know. I don't know why. It just feels like people feel a little zombified today. Merlin's just fully just watching me. Is this like dig TV right now? Oh, okay. Hello. Thanks for bowing to me. I wonder if it has anything to do with like my internet right now. Like that's the real curse of Disney Dreamlight Valley. No Wi-Fi. No. I gotta watch where I'm digging. Excuse me, Merlin. No, you're gonna stand right there? That's not acceptable well, to me. Let's hang out. I tip my hat to you. It, do I, I prefer not to take it off. Merlin has a lot of hair. Oh, that'd be so, so, so cool if you could just unlock a Merlin beard and just wear it around. Why aren't you following me? I feel like you're not following me where I can get to that spot that you're at. Thank you. Like, I'm not trying to be a jerk, but... I can't leave this little patch here like that. Raccoon, don't you start. Okay. I don't know if I have anybody as digging. Maybe Mickey? Okay, Merlin, let's go get some dark wood. Oh, look at that. And then will you give me extra? No, do you just do berries? You don't do wood? Wood is forged. Wow, that's really disappointing. Oh yeah, I did a bunch of stuff to this. Got the little fire, the little path around it. Do, do, do. And then over here, just put a bunch of these little lights. I think they're melted candles on the ground. Have a pack, cause I, I would get lost here. Like, like not only all the time, but like, <laughs> uh, like I would get lost. I would find out where I am and then immediately get lost again. Okay. I moved this over here, put a little gate around it. We got some more pumpkins over here, I think. Wow, you're really not going to give me any wood. That's ridiculous. Alright, we got some good stuff. Oh, sorry about the ambulance in the background. Oh, 
Oh, this is a tough one. Any diamonds? No. Oh, I think I'm gonna run out of room soon. I also put a chest here because Glade of Trust and uh, probably because they're so far from my house. Glade of Trust and uh, the Forgotten Lands. They're just two places where I always found myself inventory full. One more thing, but I can't find it. Oh, yellow flowers. Oh, and I put this little pool, this soul pool over and then another little path. Oh, let's get this stuff. Oh, and then there's a path from here. Oh, also whatchamacallit, the wells right there. And then, oh, over here, got a little chair. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet, but... Oh, look, it's Ariel. And, uh... I guess this would really be probably my last little bit of gardening, and then we can just go ahead and find Eric. Well, I have to organize my inventories and stuff, but then we can find Eric. Oh, and I need more pumpkins. Sell. Sell all these guys. Okay, that's 100k. This is pretty good. I guess I don't really need... I really don't need another pumpkin patch. If I did do one, I'd probably be in the forest of Valor. Do, do, do. Okay, yeah, that's all I need to do. Thank you, Goofy. Now let's go over here to this chest. Oh, that's not all I need to do. I didn't need to buy freaking pumpkin seeds. Let's put all these flowers. Go ahead and move this over. No. Transfer. Oh, I forget I can just click it, but I'm gonna sell this. Move the diamonds. And then are there any room for this, this? Oh, there. Move the flowers down here. Okay. Goofy, come back. Teleport back here. Um, buy uh, pumpkins. Thank you, sir. Oh my gosh, I was like, who's following me? <laughs> oh, I forgot all about Merlin. I mean, you can go because you don't give me more dark wood. Bye, let's hang out later. Crows are fantastically creepy. Like it's gonna be a little odd that the of all people, 
if it is the fairy godmother, that like the fairy godmother would be here. It's giving definitely Maleficent vibes. And if they do add Maleficent, oh my goodness, a castle in that style I think would look really good here. Like maybe an all black castle for her. Or like a castle that has her horns somehow um, added to the design of it. That'd be really cool. Like two towers but shaped like the horns on her head. Over here. Okay, again, another person doesn't say hi to me. Ridiculous. Oh, let me check my connection, see if it's still. Doing all right. All right, excellent connection, so it says. But yeah, this is my little routine I do every day. I can make sure I check the store every day and bring in a little bit of money every day. And then uh, I've been trying to even uh, get some dream light. I have so many, um, whatchamacallit. I have a lot of the dream light duties in the fishing category left that I need to complete. This little raccoon is really growing on me. At first I thought they looked way too creepy. I'm also not like the biggest fan of raccoons just as a species. That's just my personal opinion on how I feel about raccoons. But this one's kind of cute. I'm not gonna lie. I just think raccoons are like too crafty. Too crafty than what I'm comfortable with. Hey Donald, please don't trip. Hi. Alright. And that's Oh, and then I think in the plaza I still had a couple more things. And I think I'm done with gardening for today. I'm sure my other Oh, pick this up. And that. Oh, I'll leave that stuff. Over here. How did I why did I even like leave this without planting? Oh, yeah, I kind of want my, I kind of want a princess dress on. Dresses. I can do this in pink. I have my Ursula dress, my favorite thing. Hmm. This in yellow. Let's just do the new Moana dress. Oh yeah, that's so pretty. It's so weird that they changed the color, but it's still a pretty dress. I feel like you just could have offered it in both colors, but whatever. be more stuff that I could put in there. I would love some like sort of lawn chairs. Oh hey Wally. I would love some sort of lawn chairs to put in there. 
And then here we are, back in the forest. Oh, I put some pink lights over here by Elsa's. And then I have green lights over here by mine. Uh, let's go through here. Typically I start out with flowers. So, let's go to our flower room. And also while we're in here, we can go ahead and make some more berry salad. Yellow. I have my flowers organized by both uh, alphabetically and by color. Blue, blue green, purple. Like the. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Like the color is are organized alphabetically, and then the actual flowers are organized by color. Does that make sense? Uh, yeah. Let's go out. That's the only thing about this room. It's really, really difficult to leave. There we go. Let's go into the kitchen. I do love this kitchen. Over here, berry salad. Oh, let's go to dessert. Why should I make fruit salad? I have so many apples. Mm, yeah. Let's do the apples. Because it looks like we're low on gooseberries. Let's do five apples. Uh, oh, damn. I didn't mean to do that. Let's close out of that. Already this takes so much longer because I have to do each one individually. Start cooking. Put a dent in our apple stock. Start. Oh dang, I just threw an apple off the YouTube wants for me. Is there like too much happening? goodness it wouldn't be so funny if you just like if you did that you had to pick up the apples off the ground Ooh -hoo -hoo. all right great job let's go through here pumpkin seeds over here in the corner is typically what I do. Anything I'm going to sell is going to go down here. Um, we can put the gold in there. We're at 73 gold. Usually when I get to 99 gold, I go ahead and make... I'll sell this. Go ahead and make gold ingots. I think that's what they're called. 
And then we have those. Let's go back here. Get all the gems. Um, all the building materials. Clay, pebbles. I keep forgetting I can just do that. Um, and then uh, oh, more building, more building. And then all the fish. Oh, I ran out of room. Building materials. Oh, we have enough stone. Actually, I think I have enough stone even in my secondary inventory, so we'll sell those. Uh, iron ingots? Ooh, we have enough iron ingots too. Let's take those upstairs. Yeah. Um, what about clay? Tons of clay. It's pebbles. Alright, put these over here. Because I'll put those in my second inventory and then is so the rest of this just wood why can I put uh, oh, oregano I never tried that's why oh, can we move this fish over now Let me do what I want to do. Here, go over here. The diamond, those rubies, that stuff, whatever that is. Those, those. Alright, go back over here. Put all these away. Somebody's like, oh, I thought I just heard a person. Oh, it's Wally. <laughs> oh, this is, this is a horror game sometimes. Okay, I think these all go in my second fish inventory. Selling those, putting those upstairs, and then we can put that flower back in. Okay, oh, let's go ahead and harvest these berries. And these apples. Thank you very much. Oh, I still have Halloween jack-o'-lanterns outside my house. Um, I have no real urge to move them or to acknowledge that they are out of season. Well, the light looks so nice. They're just like little... Who says like you can't have a jack-o'-lantern year-round? Like, of course you can. Oh, what did I come back over here for? Oh, I was going to drop off these berries. Coolie. Come over here. Go around. Uh, it's a red flower. Red is in the middle. And now let's go upstairs. Oh wait, is that storage is full? Oh, this I was supposed to take this upstairs. That's why it's still in there. And everything else. Okay. Well, that's great. That's where I'm heading anyway. To 
our second living room. Oh, you got it? You got it? Um, also, let's go here. We have enough iron to make a bunch of iron ingots. Uh, I'm gonna sell that actually. Well, we can move these pebbles over here. Uh, clay and iron. Ooh, 63 iron ingots. That's pretty good. Extra flowers go over here. And. Uh, make a trip to see Goofy. Oh, wrong way. That's what I've been doing now that I have four floors. I, I don't think of the bottom floor as the first floor. I don't know why. Pumpkins, okra, all these stones. Okay, hey, thirty-eight thousand. Pleasure doing business with you. And then let's go see Scrooge's store. This is like the my little reward for doing all my chores. <laughs> let's go to the store. Cause if I just open the game and go to the store first, I lose all motivation to do anything else. Hey. This way. I love the way this looks so much. Scrooge's store. Yeah, there's no like stuff on the side. I wonder why. Did I buy everything? I have been buying like a lot. Like crazy. Oh gosh. I guess I cleared it out. There's nothing new. What's over here? I already have that. I already have all this stuff. Uh, do I have this? Greetings, Cheese neighbor. poster? <laughs> no, it's a really cool poster. Maybe I'll try to see what that looks like in my bedroom. What's this? I think I have this. I have this and I have nothing to really do with it. No, what's this? Awesome online awards. I got an award. And then... Uh, Small dark gray mosaic flooring. Cool. What's this? Oh, a sweater? Oh, a cardigan. Thank you kindly. Um this, but I'm pretty sure I have this. Maybe I don't actually. It's only $360. And then there's these pants. I'm just gonna buy them because I'm sick of looking at them. And I feel like the more you buy, the less it shows you the same thing over and over again. What's this? Green visor glasses. Okay. Those look pretty cool. Got some long gloves. What's this? Oh, boots. Orange knee high boots. And a black book bag. A gray book bag. Alright, cool. What's upstairs? Uh, windows that I already have. Oh, the octopus chandelier that I have. I'm pretty sure I have that in my bedroom. And then like a pink bed. Alrighty. I kind of want to see what those um, eyeglasses look like. Wardrobe. Glasses? That's funny. I wonder if they change at all when they're when she's talking. Uh don't I have like a futuristic Hmm, I feel like it would have to be something green. I also have some of those Wally uh,
work jumpsuits. That's what I was looking for. Either something like that. There's also that. And uh, those are those like Wally leggings. Is it these? It's these. Oh gosh, you look like a Sims townie right now. And then a top. Like this. I mean, that's something. I think I almost don't like the pants and the top together. Oh, the black and white wouldn't be too bad. Why does this look so weird to me? Like, doesn't... I think right here. Uh, what was it? Oh, the black and white. Let's do the black and white. Shoes. I don't know if you're gonna have any shoes that make any sense. Oh, something like that. I feel like this is giving me ponytail vibes. Let's do that. Oh, that's cute. That's cute. It's official. Oh, do you want to change your earrings, actually? Mm -mm -mm. Earrings. Let's do that. Wow. And then I bought that painting. I want to see what it looks like in my room. I want to see if I have it already. I might have just bought. Ooh, let's get this. Over here. as well. I think I'm going to put some more stones right here too. Here. Keep going. I can't believe I bought all the window displays. I was hoping for more dresses. Dang, I've been wildin'. Let's see. What else did I buy? Yeah, I got a new floor. Oh, and this. This might be cool in here. Like right there. kind of interesting and oh do I do have this already it looks like slightly different yeah one has like the sun around it and one has that but it's not different enough where it looks like I could put them side by side and it looks like a whole vibe Hmm. That's annoying. Here, let's try to take it in my hair and see how it looks like. No, I can already tell this is not going to happen. Yeah, no, I hate that. Okay. No, oh, I forgot I had this fallen tree in here. Oh, and this little lamp. Put that there. Let's 
All right, down to the first floor. All right, let's find Eric, wherever he is. Oh, he's in the restaurant. Oh, wait, what does it say? Oh, it just says next quest available. Okay. Hey. Hi. Sierra, I could use your help um, solving a mystery that came up while I was being held captive by Ursula. Yes, tell me everything. While she had me in her little garden, Ursula liked to taunt me with something. She said there was a way that Ariel wouldn't have to be torn between worlds anymore, that we could be together on land whenever we wanted. She said there's a kind of magic that would allow Ariel to change between human and mermaid. I've been looking in every book in Merlin's lab library, but I can't figure out what she was talking about. It must be dreamlight magic. Hmm, so it's all about changing shape. I should speak to Maui. He's got a power like that. He's been around a long time. I bet he's seen a lot of weird magic. Yeah, maybe he's he heard about something like this on one of his adventures. Thanks, Sierra. Come back and see me after you talk to him. See ya. See ya. Oh, like, am I? Are these glasses my new favorite item? I need something like that. Oh, there goes Maui right there. Oh no, I have small legs, I can't catch them. Hey! Hey, hey Sierra, how can I help you today? Got a giant crab bothering you? You want me to lasso a star? Yeah, I kind of do, actually. You're a shapeshifter, right? Ariel needs a way to turn back and forth human to mermaid. Um, how common is this kind of magic? Whoa, 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 hold on. I can shapeshift, but only because of the power of my magic hook. Okay, well, give me the hook. And before you ask, no, you can't borrow it. I was just gonna take it. Magic hooks are very personal. You could try to, you could try creating an enchanted object yourself. I mean, you're full of dreamlight magic, right? Who knows, it could work. Hmm. Yeah, I'll do that. That's what I like to hear, Sierra. You've got this. Okay, so if I'm going to help Ariel and Eric, I need to enchant something. I'll need something with dreamlight magic in it, maybe some purified night shards. I can do that. But if I'm going to be messing with dreamlight magic, I'll need something to ground the spell. Something from the earth. Maybe some white impatient flowers? Oh, I have those. Oh, so I skipped something. Sounds like Merlin's rubbing off on you, kid. You're definitely getting the hang of this magic stuff. Of course, once you got all that junk, you'll need something to enchant. Maybe Eric can help you figure that part out. Have a good time enchanting stuff, Sierra. Thank you. All right, what do I need? Oh, oh, that's not that much at all. Gosh, I thought I was like gonna take down my stock or something, but. Let's just go home and make this empty bow. I think I have some pure inside night shards. I don't know if I need it on me, if I could just be in my chest. Because it looks like it was already checked off, but I don't. I know I don't have those in my inventory on hand. Um, so five purified night shards. Oh, I only have 13. I thought maybe I would have more. Okay, five of those. And uh, let's go inside. Oh, let's drop off this oregano. Drop that off and then come inside. Now oh, there goes some white impatience right there. I'm loaded. Locked and loaded, ready to go. Over here. Chop off this yellow daisy. Uh, oh, there they go right there. Split. Oh, I have 50 in here. One, two, three, four, five. Transfer. Cool. Now let's go to our library. Across the way. Empty valve. 
Oh, it takes three things of glass. That seems excessive. Craft. Oh, go back. Craft, shape shifting, enchantments. Oh, there we go. Craft it. And return to Eric. All right, Eric, you still in the restaurant? Because that'll make my job. We're just not even gonna. You're just gonna sit there. You're not even gonna move around. Eric. Eric? Yeah, he's still here. Oh no. Saying that I need to restart. And then it disappeared. Well, I guess if it just ends, it will tell me, hopefully. It won't just be... Uh, gosh, now I forgot what I was doing. Oh. Let's go find Eric. anything I can do on my like just disconnect everything from the Wi-Fi maybe that will I don't know if that will help but let me try to do that Um, oh gosh, okay, Eric, let's go ahead and get this done before my computer completely <laughs> falls apart. Um, chanting an object that sounds familiar, wait, Ursula, when she made a deal with Ariel for her voice, Ursula needs a Nautilus shell pendant. It allows her to speak with Ariel's voice, so we know they can be enchanted. Uh, not Nautilus shell? Um, well, let's go get it. It's It won't be easy. They live deep under the waves, but maybe we can lure one up. Do I need to go fishing? They're scavengers. We'll need something that smells awful like it comes from the depths of the ocean i have this fish gut oil okay you just got that in your pocket maybe we can combine it with some other ingredients but i'm not sure what will work i'll ask for me he knows everything about <laughs> scavenging he is a rat that's great here take the fish gut oil with you and thanks again for helping me okay remy is remy in here I knew it was actually like walking around and about, but I just remember the last time I saw him, he scared the crap out of me. Oh, Remy, wait, you're literally right in front of me. Uh, give the fish oil. Am I not gonna tell him why first? I'm just gonna give him, oh gosh, I love this angle. What did you just give me, Sierra? It smells like a thousand dead fish. Yeah, I'm sorry, I really, that was really rude of me just to give you dead fish oil and not explain myself. I want to create bait for a nautilus. I need 
to it needs to stink I want to use this fish oil fish gut oil as a base um, it's gonna be fun you and I have very different ideas of fun okay are you I definitely don't like cooking so are you sure you want to turn good ingredients into disgusting slush it'll be such a waste listen this is not what this is about don't question me Fine, Sierra. Somebody's touchy today. Just don't try to eat it. I don't think it'll be safe for humans. I think lanselfish, crab, garlic, onions for the ingredients. If you bring the, me those, I'll prepare a meal no ocean scavenger can resist. In the meantime, I'll I'll keep a tight lid on your fish gut oil. Thank you, I mean. It wasn't necessary for you to keep it, but... Let's go home. Gosh, I need to finish this area. I think I am going to put flowers all through here. Maybe like pink flowers would look really good. The castle. Even though I, I think a sunflower area would look really pretty somewhere. But I think sunflower, maybe I should put a sunflower metal here. Alright, I think I have crab right here. Um, oh, how many do I need of each thing? Four? Oh, I just need one crab. And a lancet fish. I have one of those somewhere. There we go. Oh gosh, I forget it. It literally shows you and I just went through every single fish. Okay. Lancet fish, uh, four onions, four garlic. Where did I put all my food? Did I put all my food upstairs? There's garlic. And onion. Oh no, why did I put my... Goodness, goodness. Okay, go through here. I think my garlic's in here? Is that what this is? No, don't do that. That was expertly curated. Uh, yep, I sure did. One, two, three, four. Transfer back over, and we are set. This was like really painless. Bring for me the ingredients, especially like a quest to give Ariel legs. I thought it was going to be way more intense. All right, let's go take these to Remy. Remster. Oh, there he goes. Remy. Hey. Could I talk to you? Yeah. Here. Hey, it's you. I can't believe I'm doing this. Two great ingredients, but if it will help Eric and Ariel be together, I'll give it a try. Now to make the bait. Just a second. Here, now please get away from my nose. I'm going to need to smell a bucket full of fresh herbs to cleanse my palate. Alright, now what do I do? You Use the Natalis bait in your inventory to apply to your fishing rod. I feel like I say it different every time. Uh, this? Use... Okay. Fish at Dazzle Beach, where the river meets the sea. Okay. Um, I think I can go through this way. Okay, I just want to get to the beach entrance. If that's okay. Okay, going down this way. Oh, I missed one. And, uh... 
Oh, I also added these orange lights to the side. I really like them. Oh, gosh. I wasn't trying to do all that. Where the river meets the sea. Is this the river? Oh, is this it? Where the river meets the sea? I don't really see anything that's like... Maybe I'll just like fish at each of the locations. And see what comes of it. Say this looks like all sea to me. Alright, shrimp. I feel like it wouldn't be the dock because it's like they would have just said dock. They wouldn't have said where the river meets the sea. Nor would that make any sense regardless. Need the stars. I love how they come and stand by you when like you're fishing or something. The shrimp. I love how they see you, like, doing a task and they're just like, well, let's just give you some personal support. Oh, it's probably this. Absolutely. I, must, I think I just had my camera turned over here so I didn't see it. So attached to this little raccoon. Oh my goodness. Okay. Um here's Eric still where I left him. It looks like it. Wow, that was so lazy. I'm literally at the beach. Okay. Uh over here. Wow, if I would have known if when I bought everything, <laughs> this, the window signs would be empty, like, I don't know, that's not cute. It's cuter when there's stuff in the window. Uh, Eric, here you go. Oh no, am I gonna have to follow you when you need to take this up to Ariel? Like, why didn't I just give it to her? You did it, I'm impressed, Sierra. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm the best, I know. And you certainly are confident. Thank you. Now, I'll just put together the enchantment you made with Natalie's shell. Oh, that was fast. There. Now we just have to get the Nautilus 
pendant to Ariel. Okay. Oh gosh, I wish I could buy that necklace. And, uh, okay, let's do that. This is so confusing. I can't tell. <laughs> Goes from good connection to excellent connection to bad connection to good connection. Excellent connection again. Now it's back at excellent connection. Uh, I'll have to figure that out while it's doing that. Oh gosh, now I forgot what I was doing. Oh, I need to find Ariel. <laughs> Eric's like following me. I got other stuff going on, just so you know. Uh, Ariel. What, did I miss her? Oh, she's at her house. Great. Our blue flowers in the plaza. That would be cool too. Hey. Okay. Here, got you something. Oh, I just had to come a to gift from Eric? What is it? It's a necklace. It's enchanted. I sh it should help you turn human or mermaid at will, so. You can go back to see if you need a break from Eric. Oh, that would never happen, but I'm so happy we can finally be together and I can still return to the sea whenever I want to. Thank you, Sierra. I put, I'll put it on right now. Oh, I need to talk to you. Oh, wow. <laughs> All right. Oh, she looks so pretty. This is probably my favorite outfit. Like, if I was to ever um, Disney bound, which is not truly... It's not something I've done. Oh, I didn't notice there's like little stuff up here. Oh, I wonder if that happened after the quest that I did for her. Uh, Eric. Oh, and there's like her little crafting Hello. station too. Oh, oh, sorry, I'm not reading. I can't thank you enough. You're, we're finally gonna be able to enjoy our life together wow. here. Cool. All right, yeah, I'm gonna call that a day. That was like, oh, yeah, this outfit, I love this outfit. Okay, let's go. Is this something that you can go into? Hmm. Go home. Probably do one more inventory drop off. Actually, Mohana's, Moana's house, I think it would look really pretty with some flowers all around it. Oh, let's get these berries. Okay. 
Alrighty. That's my little... Oh, I forgot she was wearing these glasses. Those are great. I love those. Um, but yeah, like if you want, comment if you want, and subscribe if you're about that life. Uh, peace.